Hello everyone, welcome back. A little bit late this month for the new in haul, but Royal Mail deliveries, everything got a little bit delayed, but here we are. I'm still waiting for a, a couple of bits, um, but I thought, no, nope, I'm not waiting any longer. There's enough here to get through anyway, I think. And look, you can spot some new winter colors in there. There's a red and a bright pink, which is a little bit unusual for me. Um, there's some nice pieces in here though. A couple of transitional pieces where, I don't know, our weather's a bit funny, isn't it? You'll think it's really not nice outside and it's dark and cloudy here in the UK but you'll go out and it's like 22, 23 de degrees so it's definitely not time for the winter changeover yet I don't think but I've got lots of new winter stuff coming in now and I've got a, a new accessories haul coming up I've got some winter accessories to share with you in the next week or so so I hope you'll join me for that um yeah so let's crack on let's go through what i'm wearing now and it's an absolute delight to be able to wear this dress um a couple of weeks ago it would have been way too hot for me to wear it and it's been it's it's a beautiful dress i'll most probably wear this into the colder months as well though i think it's on sale now from balkian um but it's one of my favourites in my wardrobe. I love the ditzy print on it, uh, the little frill details, and it's just a really easy, comfortable dress. Um, if it's on sale, you won't get the discount, but anything at Balkian, I always say this, um, you'll get 15% uh, off any full price items. I'll leave the discount link down below as well everything here I'll leave the links down below and what sizes I'm wearing I'm a regular size 10 I would say now um, and I'm pretty sure all of this is in a size 10 as well so let's get going um, Brora now you should all know by now that I am a huge fan of Brora I've had a couple of pieces now this is the third item that I've had from Brora and it's this blouse uh, and it's actually a Liberty print look how beautiful that is the colors in there it's like a blue I don't know it looks lilac-y it looks mustard it looks yellow uh, you've got the cream in there but it's just absolutely beautiful as soon as I saw this I thought yep yeah, that's the one that's the one that I want you're going to be able to dress this up wear it smart or wear it with jeans is what I thought I know I'm going to get a lot of wear out of it and the detail in here on this blouse you've got a tiny tiny frill I don't know if you can see that it's really tiny it's only about that wide but I love that little detail and the sleeves so you've got this really deep cuff but it's pleated so that when you wear it that is gonna just hang beautifully and then it's quite a wide puff at the top but it was the print that did it for me I thought it's gonna go so well with everything in my wardrobe especially in my neutrals um, and that's how I'm going to style it. I'm going to style this twice, as once as a casual look and once as a dressed up look. So you'll be able to see how to wear it. It's just a plain straight back. I think I folded this in a 12 because I didn't want it to be tight. Um, I think my other shirt is a 10 in Brora, but I just wanted this to be that little bit looser. So yeah, absolutely beautiful um, that's the trousers I'm going to pair them with and then I've had this lovely shirt from Glassworks uh, it's just a very simple 
plain linen blend blouse but it's got a tie this tie so you can tie it in different ways just have it at the front you can wear it as a wrap and I thought I really like that I'll be able to do a lot with this as well um, it will look nice with a body under it I think if you want to have it a little bit open and yeah I liked the length of it it just hits at the waist you've got a nice cuff detail I'll roll them up I always do and I just thought it looked really smart I've got so many white shirts in my wardrobe they go with everything and I just thought this was a little bit different so it's another different white shirt but yeah I love it I'm really pleased with it the uh, dress that I had from Glassworks earlier in the year was actually one of the main items that I wore in that heat wave because it was just so floaty don't know if you remember the little red ditzy print um, and I wasn't too keen on it to start with and it turned out to be my most worn so yeah it's worth looking at the Glassworks brand they have some nice pieces on there and I've had these from the Artichoke Girls, Artichoke brand. Uh, if you remember, I've got that. Uh, it's a white shirt with a frill. I'll actually style it with these jeans. Um, and these are the Magic Stretch Perfect Fit. I think they're called the Montana. Two seconds. Yes, these are the Anna Montana Perfect Fit Jean with a push up effect and these are slim um, they do do different leg lengths in these jeans as well these are the short 7 8 uh, but on me they're just hitting my ankle um, I'm going to give them a try let me know what you think but they do come up in different lengths I love the fit of them I'm just not sure about the the length of them but you know we've got ankle boots coming in haven't we I can wear knee high boots over the top if the worst comes to the worst now these are pretty famous jeans if you watch uh, GMTV in the mornings Mark Hayes is always raving about these jeans um, and Sarah from Artichoke has said a couple of times you know they just sell out completely uh, yeah they feel lovely, they've got a nice stretch to them, yeah they're nice and stretchy, so yeah I'm really pleased, I love the colour, it's the colour that done it for me, this biscuit oatmeal colour, beautiful. Right, first coat of the season, uh, this caught my eye from Bon Marsh. Now I love a car coat like this, you know, it's not too long, not too bulky, but it was the colour that stood out and I just thought, I haven't had a red jacket for ages, Dee loves me in red, um, so yeah, really, really like it, cheap as chips this jacket, um, £35 and you've got lining in there as well. It's like a felt, like a felt material, um, but it will be warm enough for the first few colder months, won't it? And I just love the colour, it jumped out at me. And the reason I got in touch with Bon Marsh was for some new Julie jeggings. Now these, I don't think these are black, these are the extra dark wash. They do do them in black. Um, I'll throw a picture up of my other Julie Jeggings. I've had them, I think, for about five years. I've got the old ones in the drawer. If I can find them, I'll show you before this film runs out. But I have worn them literally to the death. Mine were this colour when I got them, and they are now like a light wash blue because they've just been worn so much like I said five years I think I've had them and I thought it's time for a new pair of Julie jeggings and 
these are just such a great easy daytime item uh, I throw these on a lot when I'm working indoors around the house they're so comfortable they hold you in nice again what I like about Bon Marsh, they do different leg lengths and they're cheap as chips I think these are something like 15 18 pounds so yeah happy with that uh, pockets on the back you haven't got pockets on the front but you've got this deep elasticated waist uh, yeah and I would really recommend them with a long you know a slouch a slouchy jumper over the top of these or a jacket they look great and they're not too skinny on so yeah really really pleased with them and to complete the look I've just got a dark this is actually black um, boat neck long sleeved t-shirt now Bon Marsh t-shirts are I've, I've said this in blog posts so many times Bon Marsh t-shirts are I think this is about eight pounds and I don't know what Primark cost I haven't been in a Primark for ages and um, but I know they do exactly the same top but these trust me are just the material the quality it's completely different um, and I've got a few long sleeve and short sleeve t-shirts from Bon Marsh I've got one cream t-shirt round neck from Bon Marsh and I've always said it's my most favourite t-shirt in my wardrobe and it still is today and they are so cheap but the quality is there so do take a look it's worth looking at the Bon Marsh t-shirts yeah so I've got that to complete the whole look that will be going online in, in one of the new blog posts the jeans are not new um, I'm just going to style this pink cardigan with the jeans actually there's a top under there as well this actually is for a campaign that I'm working on on Instagram with Damart um, we've got a nice long sleeved little tee I think that's a lovely little print on there little lady with holding the flowers um, and the cardigan I just thought that was a really cute colour to wear with a pair of jeans but what this is for is uh, Denmark's breast cancer scheme I know they do a donation um, and they work on it every year I'll leave more details down below about that um, yeah so on Instagram I will be talking about checking your boobs obviously it's important isn't it and this is what I'll be wearing the t-shirt or the jumper I'm not sure the cardigan um, yes so I'll leave my little plug to Instagram up there I'd love you to come over and follow me over there and uh, I'm going to be doing a, a question Q&A soon I'm going to try it on Instagram I might do it on here as well so let me know if you've got any questions leave a message on Instagram yeah yeah so yeah I'm proud to be part of that campaign actually now <laughs> the last two are the two items that I kept from Marks and Spencers Marks and Spencers yes and I kept this long v-neck pullover I fell in love with this with beige trousers um, I love the trousers that I got from Marks and Spencers but they were too big I am definitely buying those in a smaller size so if you didn't see the last Marks's haul pop over there I fell in love with those trousers um, yeah and I thought this went really well with the outfit I'm going to wear my Reese trousers today and style this up um, and it's nice without anything underneath but my idea was when it's really cold you can put like a silk blouse under this or a long sleeve tee and I think it will look just as good and the quality is brilliant it's a nice I wouldn't say 
too bulky but it's quite a thick jumper and I was really really pleased with it a lot of these I've tried these best before and they've just not suited me and for some reason the softness on the shoulders this, this one just worked so I was really pleased to find it right and then the dress I would say out of I had hundreds of uh, comments on that last Marxist post and I think if I didn't keep this dress you would have all beheaded me because nearly every single person said you've got to keep that green dress and so I did I took I took your advice and kept this one I do love it I do love it really really pleased with it that was a good haul I could have kept a lot from that Marxist haul but I have to rein it in um, but I think I'll get a lot of wear out of this and when it's colder I'll wear a full slip under it and I'm sure it'll be plenty warm enough so yeah that's the last item really pleased with it quick wasn't it um let me know what you think let me know what your favorite item is and are you starting to think about the winter wardrobe yet have you got any jumpers out are you swapping your wardrobe over yet um do you think it's time i hope not i'm hoping end of october that's normally when i do mine um yes so let me know I, as I said, I'll leave all the details and sizes down below in the description box. And also, if there's any special offers on, I'll note them down below as well. Right, I'd like to say thank you for watching. I'm going to say thank you to everybody lately that's been commenting on the films. It's just so lovely. A lot of, There's a lot of new people finding me and you're glad that you're finding me I'm glad you're finding me and it's just so lovely really really lovely I look forward to hearing from you so please carry on give that film a thumbs up because that helps everyone to find me and if you're new here please subscribe I'd love that and I'll see you in the next one